big. Ha, 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 ha. I'll have you this time, Zoro. Ah. Ha, ha. Yeah. Uh. Well done. Look out! Oh. Stop him! Huh. It's getting away again after him! I wish I was like Zoro. Well, I tell you what I think, boys. That Zaro is brilliant. Sure is. Have you seen the way he takes on those soldiers single-handed? Uh-huh. He's a real hero, all right. That's what I want to do. Fight the army like Zaro. Huh? Be careful, kid. Yes, be careful. Someone might overhear you. Hey, you're chicken, the pair of you. You're no better than the rest of them out there. The army walks all over you, and what do you do? Nothing, because you're too afraid to help yourselves. I'm not frightened to stand up for myself. I'm no coward. Yeah, right. Then it's time for us to fight. We have to show the army that from now on we won't stand for it. Here's to justice. To, to justice. justice. Ah, boys. Huh? Please allow me to pour you all a drink. For justice. Yeah, yeah. They're gaining on us. Yeah. Get down from that wagon! What do you think you're doing? Yeah. Get out of the wagon and you won't get hurt! All in all, an excellent day's work. Well done, I'm proud of you. And I promise I will distribute the wagon load of food amongst the poor and needy as we agreed. Wow! wow. And so I said to Maria, I must go into town to see those new dresses there. Hmm? Huh? <laughs> What's going on over there? Huh? Oh. Those boys caught the one on the ground trying to force himself on a poor flower girl in the market. They stopped him, which is a good thing. But then they started to beat him. I think they're taking it too far. You can see he's had enough. Oh, we must stop them, Diego. Don't interfere. Huh? huh? The leader of that gang over there is the son of Ferran. Ferran is in the Ferran Shipping Company? It would affect all our businesses if we were to upset that family, that's for sure. But Diego! Right. Kid, please! Stop hurting him! Go oh. away! Hey, why don't you let him go? It looks like he's had enough. Says who? We're cleaning up the town, just getting rid of the scum, that's all. Yeah, just like the way Zaro does. Hmm. Yeah, we're fighting for justice, just like Zorro. Uh, uh. We will never again allow our women and children to be bullied. And we will fight for justice in this town with or without Zorro. Come on. Oh, dear. He acts like he's so important. And he talks as if he was Zoro himself, don't you think, Diego? Yes. I'm sorry. Oh, don't be silly. It's not your fault, you know. Mm-hmm. I think I understand how they feel, but... but... They're going too far. It's our father's fault. What? What do you mean, Rosa? Kid's angry. He has fallen out with our father. We're extremely grateful for your help in this matter, Mr. Ferran. Air yeah, business is going very well at the moment, which again is a testament to your cooperation. We only wish that others would follow your example. Well, it makes good sense to embark on ventures that are mutually profitable. Good, then we can look forward to a bright future. Yes, we can, and I look forward to our next meeting, gentlemen. Good day, Mr. Ferran. Father! Why do you tolerate those men, huh? For business, son. You're just another coward. Please, kid. You're afraid of them, aren't you? As a businessman, you can't get by in this town, not without their help. Yeah. Kid! 
Kid hasn't spoken to our father since that day. I don't know what to do. I'm so worried for them. And I'm so afraid that Kid will get himself into real trouble soon. Diego? Huh? Oh, I'm not sure. I know. I have a plan. Oh, Diego! Oh! Oh, what has come over you? I don't feel much like working today, so I think I'll hang out down the market, you know. Uh, that's nothing new. Uh, I, I've never known you to feel much like working anyhow, Diego. Huh? Uh, he does have a point there, though. Anyway, I'm going to hang out with the other boys downtown. See you later. Hmm. Uh, oh, are you all right, Maria? I'm so sorry, Maria. <laughs> Would you look at Diego? I've never seen anything like it. Oh, dear. You do look awful. Well, here's to you, Kip. What next, then? Maybe we could rob a stagecoach, huh? Great idea! I'm tired of fighting deadbeats and stealing food for the poor. Look, you! You're not just ordinary thieves. We fight for justice and fair play, so don't you forget it. Yeah, sorry. Just slipped my mind. I only asked, that's all. There's no need to get physical. You look like you're having fun. Mind if I join you, huh? Who are you? His name's Diego, the only son of Alejandro Vega. They say he's run away from home, but I'm not so sure. I'm sick of being a good little rich boy. Yeah? We can't have him in our gang. He's a coward. Everybody knows it. Really? Well, we can't have yellow bellies in our gang. No way. So beat it, right? Yeah, who's gonna make me? Watch your mouth. Hey! Hey, hey pretty good. Am I in or not? Not yet. You have to go through the initiation test before you can join us. What's that? The rules are simple, Diego. We roll these rollerboards towards the edge of the cliff. And the first one that pulls up is the loser. Here's yours. Bernard? Oh, Lolita! Is Diego getting on okay with them, Bernard? What? How did you know? Diego and I have been friends for a long time. I can guess what he's up to. How's he getting on? Well, he's in some kind of race, I think. Go! The first one that jumps is the chicken. Come on, then. Hope I can stay on. He's good. Chicken up yet, Diego? We're close to the end. We'll see who's the chicken round here. We're too close. Oh! Diego! Here goes. Ah, oh, help! Hang on there, kid. I've got you. Hey, kid, are you okay? You are now wearing the symbol of our gang. From this day onwards, you can wear your cape with pride. Yeah, welcome to our gang. You are the first person that's ever beat me on the chicken run, Diego. Well done. Well, to be honest, I think I surprised myself. You will have to show consistent bravery if you want to stay with us. Yeah, and kid's the bravest of us all. What we just did wasn't bravery. It was sheer stupidity, kid. Huh? Kid. Here's details of our next mission. What mission? You'll see soon enough. We have a job to do. Hooray! I must find out who that letter's from. Done, Diego. Thanks. What are you gonna do with all this wheat? 
We are going to redistribute it fairly amongst the poor and the needy. But how? Are you surprised? We've managed to gather all this food together for redistribution. Yeah, have done well, boys. Yeah, well, we followed all your instructions right to the letter. I see a new face. This is Diego, our new recruit. Don't make this type of decision, not without consulting me. You don't have to worry about him, he's our friend. Aren't you, Diego? That's right. Look, kid, you just follow my orders and everything will be fine. If you don't, there could be trouble. You understand? Yeah. All right, then. I'll be in touch when I have another job for you. Be careful. He's certainly a hard man to please, isn't he? Well, I don't like him one little bit. Yeah, he treats us like we were babies. Then we'll have to show him that we can work by ourselves. But how? There's a ship carrying gold and fresh army supplies. It arrives at the port tomorrow. And we're going to rob it. We'll be like pirates on the high seas. Help! Help somebody! <sighs> Could you tow me into port? I seem to have damaged the rudders somehow. Commander! Okay, soldier, yes. The girl requested she may board ship and thank you in person, sir. Ah, bring her on board, soldier. Oh, thank you for rescuing me, Commander. Whatever can I do to repay you? Oh, nothing. It's a soldier's duty to rescue a young lady in distress. <laughs> now, don't move! Bring everyone on deck right now! Nobody move or he gets it. Guns. And here's gunpowder. There's really going to be trouble this time. So we've been double-crossed, huh? I'm very sorry. I never imagined they would do such a thing. The wheat crop in Spain has failed this year, so... they will pay any price we ask. Yes, I think you're right about that. But now, those idiots you can't control have sunk our ship. We can't carry the wheat back to Spain now, even if we had it because of you. But I have an idea. It might solve our problem. Will it work? Yeah, leave it in my capable hands. Um, Father, Kit didn't come home again last night. Oh, really? Aren't you worried? Forget about him. And have you finished looking at those accounts I gave to you? Business, business, that's all you ever think about. Can't you see what this is doing to us? Father... Please, Rosa. You must listen. Hmm? Excuse me. A man from the South India Trading Company is here to see you, sir. I'm coming. I hope someday you'll understand. <laughs> it was so easy. I couldn't believe it. Yeah, but what do we do next? I'm not sure. Now listen, please. I really don't think we should do this again. Don't worry, Diego. It's only what Zorro would have done, huh? 
Yeah, right. We'll all become heroes, just like Zaro. Yeah, but Zaro doesn't fight for personal glory. Oh, yeah? You talk as if you were Zaro himself, are you? Of course not. I mean, just that if we carry on like this, the army will kill all of us one day. There's more than one way to fight the army. So what can we do, Big Shot? You're the son of a rich family, not poor like us, Diego. You haven't seen your friends tortured by the army as we have. You know nothing at all. Hey, kid, here's a message for you. The man wants to see you. It says here he wants to apologize. Hmm? Okay, I'm here. Start talking. But make it fast. We're busy. This won't take long, kids. <laughs> What's going on? Do I advise you to follow my orders to the letter that it's out of my hands? No, kids. I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> Stop him! Don't let him get away! So long, sucker. Diego! Ah! <laughs> well, kid, I have one more job for you to do before we're done. <laughs> Incredible. Where did you get all of this wheat from? There are many things of which you know nothing, Ferran. For instance, you will be transporting all of this wheat to Spain for us on your ship as soon as possible. And for this, you will be paid handsomely. No, I won't. Mm -hmm. huh? You what? I have my integrity as a businessman to consider. This wheat is obviously stolen, so I will have no part in this deal. But I am willing to forget this whole conversation. It's too late for that. Kid? Kid! Your son has been helping us collect the wheat. Are you surprised, Ferran? <laughs> Untie him at once! Yes, of course. We will return him to you as soon as we know the wheat has reached Spain. <laughs> well, do we have a deal? <laughs> Wait! I'll do as you say. You don't have to. Who's huh? that? <laughs> You! Get him! You'd steal the food from the mouths of the poor just to line your own pockets. This shall not be. Get him! Kid! Get out of here! Zaro, we fight together! Take care of your father and your friends, kid! Get out of the way, you fool! A gun! Uh, oh. ah. Father! Ah. Huh? Oh, please, no! will follow you as long as you continue to do evil. Please, everyone! I'm sorry. It's my fault. They fooled me. Please forgive him. We're all to blame, really. It wasn't his fault. We were all taken in by them. Yeah, that's right. We all were. No, really, I... Kid. Huh? You have good friends, son. <gasps> yeah, they're the best! Mr. Ferran, you understand now that the South India Trading Company are your sworn enemies? 
They'll not let it rest there. Yes, I know. And I will continue to fight them my way, as you will continue to fight them in yours. Our struggle will not be over until there's justice for all. Mm-hmm. Father. Oh, we've completely forgotten about Diego. He fell into the harbor. Come on. Help, help, get me out, help. Help me pull him up. Are you all right, Diego? Next time, remind me to bring my swimming costume, will you? <laughs> <laughs> In the next exciting adventure of Zorro, a lady inventor comes to town and causes havoc with her crazy machines. The army is on red alert when a knight in armor appears and tramples all over them, which gets Lieutenant Gabriel very hot under the cock. When she builds a submarine, Bernard and his friends go on the maiden voyage. All goes well until it springs a leak. Will our hero become fish food? Find out in the next exciting episode of Sorrow!